Sports update is next with the German Peter Nwati as our guide. The chairman of the National Sports Commission, Shen Wudiko, has expressed his delight over Team Nigeria's outstanding performance at the just concluded African Scrabble Championship in Kigali, Rwanda, when he received the team in his office at the Moshud Abiola National Stadium, Abuja. Team Nigeria emerged victorious, winning seven out of the ten prizes at the tournament. If we focus on the development, we can also sustain doing the uh, the trophies. We have said we have been winning this for the past 15 years. Only one year you, you, you lost. So it shows clearly you are doing something right. So going into this uh, 15th Africa Scrabble Championship was one that uh, we were a bit confident, or let me say we were 80% confident that we will win. Because we know that no other African nation does what we do in Nigeria. Meanwhile, President of the Nigerian Football Federation, Ibrahim Guso, has once more provided clarity on the essence of sponsored local football tournaments, saying it is to identify talents worthy of being nurtured. Guso gave the assertion while receiving a tournament trophy in his office in Abuja, where he praised the organizers and charged them to ensure the inclusion of more local teams as a way of providing opportunities for rookie to get the much-needed exposure. The tournament, which is set to bring together NNL clubs from across the country, is scheduled for the Amadou Bello Stadium, Kaduna, from November 12th to 20. And now to the Nigerian Premier Football League, as two games will be decided Saturday with Bender Insurance welcoming Kanu Pillars at the Samuel Obemudia Stadium, Bini City, while Lobby Stars of Makodi takes on Abia Warriors. And finally to tennis, Chong Chingwang continued her breakthrough season with victory over Barbara Krejcikova to reach the final of the season-ending WTA Finals. China Strong reached the Australian Open final in January before clinching Olympic gold in the summer. She now has a chance to secure another prestigious title after beating Webledon champion Krejcikova 6-3-7-5 in the semi-finals in Saudi Arabia. Chong, who is only the second Asian player to reach the final, will take on Coco Gulf on Saturday. With sports updates, Ijoma Pitawante, NTA News.